Awesome. What's up guys, it's your boy John. I think I finally feel more comfortable talking about my past. Although most people already know my past, I've watched my channel anyways. So I'm mostly going to be talking about the positive stuff of the past. Because you probably know more of the, the negative stuff. I'm going to talk more about positive because I want people to leave in the video feeling motivated, not filled with anger. Like, that's not what I'm about. But if you watch the video, hopefully it become more positive and inspire you to do more and become more. So, one question I'm asked a lot is, you know, do I love my dad? For those of you guys don't know, I'm from a polygamous group. My dad has 14 wives and about 160 kids. And so I'm asked a lot, do I love my dad? Uh, I couldn't quite go as far as saying I love him, right? But he has taught me some things that has, I'm still doing today and values and certain things that has benefited me a lot. So for that, I do respect him and I like him as a human being, but I couldn't go as far as saying I love him. So having this great positive attitude for me actually has been working awesome. I'm going to the University of Utah right now. Um, on my way to graduation and it's because of the positive attitude that I had that brought me to where I'm at today. So if any of you guys are feeling down, you know, if you look for the negative, you will find the negative. But if you look for the positive, you will find positive. And who wants to live a negative life, right? So I would advise you strongly to just look for the positive and I guarantee you, no matter where you're at now, it will get better as long as you're looking for the positive and moving off that and growing off that. For the rest of the video, I'm going to be talking about the people that brought me here and some of the people that I was fortunate enough to motivate. There was this other polygamous kid that left a different polygamous group. He left and he was feeling down, um, depressed. And after watching the video on escaping polygamy that I was in, he said you know, that he has hope now. After watching what I did, he said he has hope now. That for me is huge. I'm going to go over some of the comments that some of the people sent me on Facebook. It means a lot to me because, you know, I like helping people out. So it means a lot to me when you guys send me those comments. Thank you guys for the guys that send me those comments. So we'll dive into the first comment. It says, hey, so you're probably wondering why I added you. Or maybe you know. I've been watching the show you were on for a couple years, and I searched your name because I thought your story was motivational and inspiring. Also, you're really cute. I know you probably removed me after this, but I wanted to say it because I don't know. Your story touched my heart and it made me want to personally tell you myself. How much it impacted me, your story made me cry. Ha ha. I wouldn't mind getting to know you because you seem like an amazing guy. I'm glad you're doing better and making a life for yourself independently. I'm not sure what else to say. I was kind of nervous writing this, but I'll leave it to you and hopefully we can chat or something haha ha. well I hope you have a good night okay um, I'm just gonna go to this one so it says I just finished watching the last episode of escaping plug me after the escape and I have to say that you are amazing your mom would be so proud of what you are doing. I'm thankful you found a family who loves you and I pray your, your life just keeps getting better. You are a good, kind, and gentle man. God bless you, always. Oh. So I'm just going to scroll through most of these. I'm not gonna have enough time to show you all of them, so I'll just um, show you some of them. Huh. You're really cute. Oops, laws. Sorry, didn't mean to type that. That's a good one. So just wanted to say I saw your video on Vice and it inspired me to question life and authority around me. Sorry I wasn't able to get to all your guys' comments. It's just a lot of comments, but thank you guys so much for sending them to me. It really inspires me to keep moving. Thank you guys for that. But I really hope it also inspires you guys because I want to see you guys also winning too. So go out there, do what you love, do a good job, and I'll see you guys later. Thanks, guys. See ya. Pound it, knock it, gerbil. <laughs>